Welcome to the 1204. In this video, I'm going to be discussing Tom Likas and his contradictions. Not only his contradictions, but Tom Likas is a simp. I've had a few debates with some Tom Likas fanatics. And on YouTube, especially channels like um, Tom Likas and Kevin Samuels and all these, all these types of YouTubers. I don't think Tom Likas is actually a YouTuber, but his content is floating around on YouTube. These guys are so fanatical that they can't even see when, when, when their hero, i.e. Tom Likas, is not making any sense. Tom Likas has made videos, loads of videos, and he says, do not give a woman money. But then, in these other videos, he will tell you, I can get hot women, I can get hot women because I am rich. So, if you're not giving women money, but you're getting hot women because you're rich, that means that you're giving these women money. And when I said that to one of, the, to one of his fans, his fans' response was, um, no, the women are sleeping with him because he is rich, not because he's giving them money. It's just the fact that he's rich, they're sleeping with him. And I'm like, listen to what you're saying, you idiot. You're telling me that women are going to sleep with this man just because he's got money, not because he's giving them money. How does that make sense? What would be the point of them sleeping with him if they're not, if they're not going to reap the benefits of Tom Lager's wealth? It doesn't make any sense. I'm not being funny. Tom Likas is not a good looking man. He's overweight. He's very ugly. And I, and I know Tom Likas has said online that, that um, men don't have to be good looking. Well, let me tell you something. There is a standard of beauty for men. Yeah? There's a reason why you see... Um, you know, you know, there's a reason why male strippers look a certain way. Male strippers do not look like Tom Likas. There is a standard of beauty. Women cheat a lot. A lot of these women married to fat, ugly men like Tom, who, who are rich. They have like a boy toy on the side. Who they even give money to. Jeremy Meeks was a criminal. This guy had his picture up. His picture went viral, and guess what? He married a billionaire. Jennifer Lopez, I think back in 2014 or 15, she was dating her dancer who was 27. And who was considered an attractive younger man. So, to think that women are not attracted to looks is a damn lie. And this is the kind of thing that men in the mid to, no sorry men in the red pill community pedal. It's just like women coming out and saying that um oh men don't care about um women being blah blah blah. But then um, a bunch of men are saying that actually we do. Let me tell you this right now. Yeah? The only reason why a woman will go for Tom Likas is because of money. There is plenty of gold digging channels on YouTube. And these women who gold dig, they actually encourage women to go for men like Tom Likas. The uglier, the better. The uglier, the older, the better. Because they can end up getting more money. So, for Tom to say... It's because he's rich, that's why these women are sleeping with him. It's not true at all. Tom Likas is giving up money. No woman is going to sleep with that man. Also as well, there was a time Tom Likas was talking to a young lady. And I think she had four babies or whatever. 
Uh, Tom Likos' response, I think she had three babies, and, he, and his response was, um, she said I made a mistake. And he said, a mistake is once, maybe twice, not three times. Okay, with that same logic, he got married four times. He got married four times. And those women didn't, were not attracted to him. You know, they, they only married him for money. And I know why he's got a lot of fans. Sadly, there's a lot of men out there who look like Tom. Most of these, let's face it, Tom Lacker's fans are not going to be six foot plus Adonis looking men. They're not going to look like Jeremy Meeks. They're not. They're not going to look like Tyson Beckford. So basically, Tom Lackers gives hope to them. He is charismatic, he is funny, yes. But there is no way these women are looking at, at that man and thinking he's attractive. There are men out there who are not even... I'm sorry, there are men out there who are not even rich. And they're very attractive men. And guess what? They're able to get women. I've heard Tom Lackers say that um, only rich men can get hot women. I'm thinking, that's rubbish. You see rich guys, go down to Miami Beach, go down to, um, what do you call it, um, Cancun on a spring break. Those guys you see on the beach with the beach bodies are not millionaires. And they're still able to get women. Tom has to pay for women. And it's the same thing, because you've got to remember as well, if you think a 21-year-old is really going to look at Tom and start getting wet... Then you guys are more delusional than I than I think you are. Same thing with uh, Kevin Samuels. You know, it's funny because um, you know, when I was when I was younger, I remember girls would always talk about how they have all these older men who they bops for money. Bopsing means basically, you know, finessing. Think about it now, you're not gonna finesse a young twenty five year old, do you understand? And, and of course they don't have money, I get that, but it's mostly foolish, fat, older men. And I, I don't know, I just want to listen to what this guy has to say. This is the man that refers to people with normal jobs as a loser. And do you know what, I do like Tom's, Tom's content. <clears throat> I think sometimes he does make sense. But then I disagree with him about, um, you know, not giving a woman money because I believe he does do that. And remember, if you're giving a woman money in the Red Pill community, that's simping, right? 